Hi, my name is Marshall Spratt, and I'm the Assistant Technical Director of the museum. Well, the treadmills, I think, are unique to entertainment so far because we're actually using industrial-scale mining equipment. These things are heavy, they are intense, they are robust, um, and it's taken a lot of work to get them where they are now. Because the turntable can move in two directions at the same time, we have to be pretty diligent. The floor's got to be right, then the first treadmill has to be facing the right way, then the second treadmill has to be facing the right way. From there, we actually test them every show to make sure that the signal we're sending is the, the action that we expect. Once those steps are done, we're show ready. And once the guys really got a grip of the apparatus, the conceptors started messing with timing and direction. Once we put all that together and then spin it on a turntable, you end up with something quite dynamic. The Hoop Diving Act for me is all about uh, big energy. What better way to spend energy in one place than running on a huge treadmill? <laughs>One of the most satisfying moments for me technically is the opening of the show, where the disc rotates and the lights come up and the key turns and the treadmill starts. We're brought from a stagnant place to an active place. It's hard to tell from sitting in the house, but I think more things move in that second than they do in the rest of the show.